Hi, I'm Holly. You probably know me better as the fingernail fixer. That's this cool turtle girl polishing her nails. I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this nail tutorial. I really appreciate it. Today, this video is aimed at gardeners. So it's more of a nail tip versus a tutorial. The first thing is you really should wear gloves. I know, I know, don't turn off the video yet. If you're not gonna wear gloves, I'm not gonna hold it against you. My grandma didn't wear gloves either. She told me she really needed to feel the dirt. It was very important. So this tip is gonna be for you whether you wear gloves or don't wear gloves. It's still gonna be a helpful tip. Get a bar of soap. It doesn't matter what brand it is, what kind it is, just a bar of soap. And if you're more of a body wash kind of person, just grab a bar of soap on your next grocery run, drugstore run, etc. Just a plain old bar of soap. Let's switch to under camera so I can show you the next thing. Chances are good as a gardener, you often get dirt and other things under your nails when you're doing your gardening, even if you're wearing gloves. And sometimes you even get one of those tiny little sticks that really wedge under there and break the seal under your nails. That little piece of skin growing under there that attaches to your nail plate is called the hyponychium. That's a really important seal. The hyponychium prevents bacteria and other things from getting to the nail bed. Sometimes when you break that seal, it can cause the nail plate to separate from the nail bed and allow for infections or simply the separation. And you see kind of a white space up here showing that your nail plate is separated from the nail bed. To prevent those separations or little bacterial infections, what you can do is take your bar of soap and dig your nails across that bar of soap a few times to just wedge some soap up under your nails so that it's really stuck in there under that hyponychium and it will just kind of wedge itself into the hyponychium really well and once it's stuck in there up against that hyponychium you can either put your gloves on or just go garden in the dirt with it wedged against the hyponychium. With the soap wedged against the hyponychium and protecting it, you'll find that you're less likely to have the dirt wedged into that skin under there or even get those little sticks poking into that skin. And so the soap protects your hyponychium. Then when you're done gardening, you come in and wash your hands, hopefully, and when you wash your hands, the soap simply melts away, eliminating the issue that you would normally have getting the dirt out of that skin, as well as getting any little sticks that would damage that hyponychium. So that was your nail tip for gardeners. I hope this helps and you have a great summer gardening.